Hi folks, this is Graham um, with the weekly update on the Breathing Spaces project and once again I'm at the Works Gallery in Prittlewell and I'll just flip the camera around and you can see what's kind of going on and Warren's here today who's the director at the Waterworks project and he's been doing, we're, don't worry we're keeping nicely socially distant, we're, we're well apart but he's actually doing some work on the garden today so I'll show you what's been going on and Warren's been working on these containers this afternoon so you can see we put tomatoes in, rainbow chard there's some uh, purple sprouting broccoli, some runner beans so it's all looking good when you think what that that container looked like just a week ago when it was full of kind of weeds and uh, plants that were coming to the end of their life um, Say hello Warren Hello <laughs> There he is hello, <laughs> Okay um, But the, 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 the big update in terms of um, the Breathing Spaces project we're kind of, you know, obviously lockdown is kind of grinding on and I know there's kind of talk that things might start to relax soon but um, it's still going to be a slow process I think and I don't think we're going to be getting back to um, the garden spaces at Chaucer House and Keats House and the other South Church, uh, the other South End Homes properties that soon so we thought rather than you know people are kind of wanting to get doing a bit of gardening and stuff like that so we thought as people still can't get to the gardens at this point we thought well we'll kind of bring bring the garden to bring, if you can't come to the garden we'll bring the garden to you or to people who might be interested so we're going to be creating kind of a garden a home garden kit where we'll be supplying a uh, a key keg container or planter I don't know if you remember I talked about these last week we get these key kegs these key kegs are actually from uh, Lee Brewery they've sent us a few or given us a few of their um, old key kegs or used key kegs and it's great from their point of view it kind of keeps them out of the waste stream they're being reused so we're going to make a uh, get like I say a little kit where we'll supply a planter we'll supply some compost or soil and we'll supply a uh, tomato plant it probably won't be as big as that tomato plant I'm afraid that's kind of quite a, a grown on one and maybe some other plants like Swiss chard and lettuce something like that and then people can we'll, we'll deliver these to people who are interested and people can have these you know if you've got like a balcony or a yard, or a little space by your front door, or something like that. You can just have your own little mini food garden growing. And we thought it'd be nice to maybe um, people could share their photos on social media, Instagram, that kind of thing. And we can like follow the progress of how people are going, getting on with their their socially isolated garden, mini gardens. So. Yeah, there'll be more, more on that soon. We're just kind of getting all the components together. Like I say, we've had a delivery from uh, Lee Brewery, who's given us, you can see a few over here. And we've got some plants. Um, these plants are actually for the waterworks, but we'll be getting some more kind of smart plants, things like that that we can distribute to people so that's a quick update on what we're doing and yeah I guess that's about it for now so uh, take care, stay safe and uh, see you next week if not before